Welcome to Max Makerspace. Can't wait to give you a tour of the space, show you what's new and what we're developing for this coming year. So we'll start in our meeting slash classroom slash kitchen. Um, we host Rotary Club meetings, uh, large classes, um, and other events here, and of course, lunch. We have a number of offices that we rent out to our members. Makers of all sorts need their own private space and we have it here. Just this past year, uh, thanks to funding from NH Gives, we were able to open up um, a new gallery space for the Peterborough area that can feature younger emerging artists and artists who are doing things that don't necessarily get shown in our and the galleries of our region. In this other space here, we have um, a new computer classroom. Finally allows us to do really top-end design classes. So you can take work that you learn how to do here and then make things in our workshop. Well, welcome to our workshops. Um, we've done a lot of work on these shops over the years. Uh, a lot of hard uh, volunteer hours been put into this. Um, our wood shop is first. It's one of our most popular areas in the space. We have um, all our machine tools. We have a CNC over in the corner. And then over here is our brand new lathe area where we've been running weekly turning classes over the last two months. Thanks to a grant from the New Hampshire Guild of Woodworkers, we are able to acquire four new lathes. Uh, that are great and um, we have a bunch of inst instructors that are really excited to be able to teach on them. Next shop here is our textiles room. Um, it's used by a dedicated group of sewers and fiber artists. We meet every Sunday afternoon, um, which is it's open to the public for an open studio um, where anybody can come in and work on their projects and get training on our sewing machines. One thing we're excited about this year is to add a long arm quilter, um, which will be available for the quilting community in our region. Uh, that'll be available in the, in the next month or so. We have screen printing, very popular here. We have a four color printing press uh, and dryer combination here. Next area is our robotics club. High school students from all around the region work on robots like this one here. This is this year's and you know every year they make something new. Here we have our 3D printers. Three form 3D printers here which use a resin to create 3D models like this. We also have a bunch of other 3D printers that use the traditional spool. And over here we have our laser cutter, probably our most popular machine. Um, can etch and cut a wide variety of materials um, like wood, um, plastics, um, leather, fabrics. Our bike shop, so a high school student last year helped us put together a bike shop for the community. We've got a great bike stand and every sort of tool you need to tune up your bike here. So this is our new jewelry section. Um, put a lot of work into this this past year, building new benches, purchasing equipment for silver work uh, and soldering. We have uh, instructors that we're bringing in that will be offering uh, silver classes and other jewelry classes over the next year. So now you've seen Max now, um, let me tell you about what we want to do in the coming year. Um, one thing is we need to um, purchase a new laser cutter, um, as are the one that we have now, which I said was super popular, um, is getting on an age and we need to find the money for a new one. We also want to have a new welding section that allows us to teach classes in welding, introductory classes in welding. All the classes that we offer, um, we want to offer scholarships for young people and low income individuals uh, so that it's, they're available for the entire community. Um, in order to do that, we need um, funding for our scholarship program. So the money that you provide for NH Gives goes to support those programs which directly benefit um, the people who need it most in our community. Thank you, I hope you support us for NH Gives.